Hello everybody and welcome back to a new Peanuts video. <laughs> well, hold on. <laughs> Project Peanuts video. Um, this time I'm going to talk about Magic Card Market. That's also a really cool site that everybody could use. It's a great site where you can sell and buy Magic Cards and products. And it's like uh, a second hand, uh, well, beacon or place, marketplace really, where you can choose uh, to buy from other people in uh, Europe. Uh, I'm gonna show you the site in a minute. I do not have uh, any uh, software that I can re record my uh, desktop with, so I'm just have to do. I have to do it with uh, the camera right here. So it may be a little bit terrible, but hey, I'm just gonna show you how it works because everyone can uh, make an account in Magic Card Market in Europe, uh, and you can uh, sell cards if you want or buy cards if you want. But it takes a few steps to do that, and that could be a little bit hard. So I'm gonna show you a little bit, uh, the best I can do, to uh, how you can activate your account and do things with it. But first, let's take a look at the site. All right, this is the best I can do. Uh, it's not the best quality, but hey, I'm just gonna show you. This is Magic Card Market, this is your interface. So if you want to re register, you just have to click on the right above here and fill out this whole uh, form. It does take a while because, uh, let me show you, it, you have to like have all your stuff, personal data, username, password, and uh, if you want you can refer back to someone like me and if you buy something I get a minus, minor bonus, so you can do that. Um, yeah, so if you want to do that, it's, it's completely free this is, uh, you can just uh, do it and uh, activate your uh, account if you want. At first you just have an account so you can look at the, at the things, well let me just sign in as me because I also have a Magic Card Market account and then you have your interface it's quite easy uh, on the left you see if you have to do something uh, with orders and everything well at start you don't have that yet of course there you have it I'm not gonna explain the whole uh, selling and uh, buying uh, way because there's a, a lot of FAQs on this side where you can see but let me take an example of how much cards there are available here. If we see, this is the Battle for Zendikar section only. You can buy different things, you have the booster boxes, boosters and singles. Let's just take a look at the singles here. Uh, well, let's just take a Mythic, Gideon, over here. Of course you, you see the card. You have the card right there and you have different options with it. You see the price, uh, the price trend, lowest and foil. But that's not all because if I zoom out, <laughs> On the, with the best I can do. Uh, below here you see all the people that have this for sale and you can click on your language as you can see over here uh, if it's foil if you want a near mint one uh, and here you you see what price it is huh? sorry over here on the right and you can simply add them to uh, your uh, shopping cart and uh, then the other person sends it to you in an envelope and that way you get your Gideon now of course you have the risk that uh, your mail uh, is being lost or uh, when people don't send it. But Magic Card Market has the best system for that because if you uh, mess up your uh, orders or you don't send them or you uh, say it's near mint but it's really not, then you get bad reputation. And if you have a lot of bad reputation, uh, nobody will buy from you. So you really have to take care of uh, getting a name out there, you know, so you have to get good prices on, on your cards. Uh, for example, the Gideon is now, what, what was it again? Like 18 euros on this site? Well, the lowest one, near mint English, is in fact, yeah, 1847. You have to be below that if people want to see it, because if you uh, sell it for 19 euros, yeah, you go down the list, obviously. So that's a, that's a thing to get a lot of, uh, well, uh, deals. But of course you can choose your own price if you don't want to set it that low. Sure, just put it there and maybe you'll sell it anyway. Some people only buy from certain countries and everything. Alright, so let me show you how that works. Because if you had a deal, uh, you get reputation over here. Here it says mine. And down below, over here, <laughs> Man, I feel so crappy without software that I can record my desktop, but hey. Here it says uh, what I did. This is all positive, except for this one over here, down below here. <laughs> but that's neutral, so that's not even bad. But uh, that way people can see that you're a reliable trader and you ship fast or terrible or 
whatever. That way you can choose from who you want to buy. So if you uh, don't really like the way that uh, the cards are sent by that one person, you can just choose to get another one. It also have, has a lot of other features uh, where you can add your wants or add a deck list and you can buy instantly or see who has the most hits on your wants. So it's really good to use this. Uh, the only thing if you want to activate your selling and buying thing, at first you have one account and you can't buy or sell yet. If you want to do that you can click on activate, excuse me, recording, and uh, you can click on that and link your bank account with your account. So you have your bank and your account just takes a few days before it's linked but then you can transfer money from this side your bank towards your account so you have your magic car market balance over here also if you sell cards which goes the same way uh, you first get your money in your magic car market account and you can just click on one button and within two or three or maybe four days you get your money on your bank so it's really simple it's really easy i hope i described it well with my hands so that way you can just uh, well these are my things that way you can just add your own offers on the site over here you have all my cards that I put there let me just zoom in a little bit so you can see what kind of cards I put on uh, and that way you can get rid of anything really because there are a lot of buyers on this site so there's always something who wants your card or your weird portal card or your excellent uh, pff, Sylvan library I don't know everything and you can just add play sets, foils, uh, even multiple cards. So yeah, if you have thousands of squires, you can just add them to the site. Be sure to check out the site because it's a really nice site and once you get the hang of it, it's really the best site uh, with prices to get your comments and, and everything. Even if you want old sets, old boosters, special sets, weird promos, Asian, judge, misprints, everything is on there, you have to check it out. And be sure if you do and you want to sell or buy or get an account there, uh, mention me, Pro Peanuts, that's my username on Magic Car Market for the referral and then that way I, I see who entered Magic Car Market. That's really nice. Also thank you Magic Car Market for uh, letting me do this for you. I uh, really wanted to do it. I tried my best. It's not the best video maybe but hey, the video is out there so people will know about it. And uh, yeah, until the next video guys. Later!